Today we are going to be taking India's finest train and here it is in all of its grandeur. I love the contrast as well, the old and the new. And then we have the touch screen. Really? Oh. It was 4,700 rupees, which is about 47 pounds. It turns out. <laughs> we look there quite we good. Are. It's quite a nice photo actually. Whoops. Don't drop it. Do we have? <laughs> later welcome to the blue city here in Rajasthan good afternoon and welcome to Ahmedabad train station today we are going to be taking India's finest train India's semi bullet train the Vanda Bharat Express from Ahmedabad all the way to Jodhpur in Rajasthan and we've heard that this part, this route where the Vanda Virat Express runs, also known as train number 18, is the fastest in the country. This can go up to, I believe, 200 kilometers an hour and here it is in all of its grandeur. Honestly, Indian trains are amazing, but this being new, modern, semi-high speed, looking like a bullet train, I think just makes the journey so much cooler. I'm really excited. Well, I'm definitely a fan of the Ahmedabad train station. Look, they've got a huge mosaic out the front of Gandhi. So there are actually 34 routes of the Vanda Birat train but this one is actually the newest from Ahmedabad to Jodhpur only two months old we have just found out and look at it it is so different to your more traditional type of Indian train it is like the sort of things that you would find in maybe a Switzerland in maybe a Japan and the fact that we get to go on India's fastest train on the new fastest route from Ahmedabad to Jodhpur is incredibly exciting. I think there are two classes, AC and EC. We have gone for EC, which is the slightly more expensive wow. version. Executive chair. Executive I chair. I don't actually know what the difference is, but we are, oh, this is E1. Are we E1? We are E1. I didn't realize it was this close. I love the contrast as well, the old and the new. Yeah, I mean, like I said, Indian trains are like amazing. This country's huge, so you need to use the trains to get around. But the fact that you have a new one. I think um, eventually, it's really good. This will say, they will take over every yeah, route in the possibly. country. Possibly, and also just to point out, Indian trains are very difficult to actually book for foreigners. So again, a massive thank you to Raj from Train Ticket Please, because without him, we wouldn't be able to travel on the Van der Let's do it, this never gets easy with a suitcase. Oh. Is this E1? E1, are we in E1? Okay, thank, thank you. you. It's very dark. What's happened to the Van der Why is it so dark? So we did actually do the Van der between Bangalore and Mysore. This looks different. It does. Oh. Yeah. Wow. I actually wasn't yeah. expecting it to look like this. It's okay. so yeah. different to the one that we got. And look, I don't understand why it's so dark. It's like all the lights are off. But again, you have all your storage up here, the seats, the room here. Look at this. Hang on. Got bag one, bag two, and ankle leg. It's perfect. Even a giant suitcase like that it fits right up the top. I think we have a spinny chair. No, we don't. I'm not sure. We've had a spinny chair before that goes 180. Do we oh, go 180? Okay, oh, there you go. So it says sunken. So the sunken trays are in here. Quick, move And then if you wiggle something there, we can apparently rotate round. Let's show you what we've got. So we have a giant footrest with lots and lots of leg room. We have. <laughs> how does it come out? Oh, there we go. We have our dinner tray that folds out. I like that. It. So it's like being on a plane. It's really good. Previously, when we did a Vanderbrae, it was only two hours, so we didn't get food. But I believe this one is almost six, yeah. heading to Rajasthan. So we should get some food involved. We have some plugs under there, which is definitely needed. And then we have the touchscreen. Really? Oh, 
that was so cool. I was not expecting that. But the thing is, the chairs are, they're not locked into place, which is quite annoying. It's wobbly. It's a bit wobbly, but yeah, I'm pretty impressed. I was just looking at our ticket just to check the price and yes, food will be included because we have vegetable food option on here. But it was 4,700 rupees, which is about 47 pounds for a six hour semi high speed train journey with this much space. Brand new. I think it's so, brand new. so new. So new. I think it's such good value. So this is why you need to travel to India by train. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you for We are off. And we have a big box of. Oh wow, what is this? The newspaper. Thank you very much. Do we. One is okay, one is perfect. Look at this. We have a. Oh no, we have one each. No, it's just a really big newspaper. What's going on in the world? So you have to open the doors to a bank that works just for you. That's just an advert. I don't understand. Indian newspapers. Look at the size of them. I can barely read it. I wasn't expecting that. A newspaper. Big water. And we're off six hours from Ahmedabad to Jodhpur. And this is why you get the train, right? It's cheaper than flying. And India's a giant country. If you fly, you miss all of this in between. Okay, this train ride has already become my favourite train ride ever. We're sat here, minding our own business, looking out the window, taking in the views. Molly hadn't started, what one is it? Molly hadn't started reading the Times, the Sunday Times of India, when <laughs> some of the other people in the train in front of us turned around and said, is this you? And it turns out... We there look quite we good, are. it's quite a nice photo actually. Funnily enough, we have Mr. Mike Matt. Yeah, they got my name wrong. I've been called Mike Matt. But, wearing um, the same top. <laughs> wearing the same top. This video is going to be a little bit late. You're going to have already seen our India Pakistan vlog. But this one today, you'll probably see in a few weeks' time. So this is insane to see that we, a couple from England, travelled the seven seas to witness the World Cup in India. We sure did. Mr. Mike Matt. <laughs> What do we have? We have a big tray. Oh, Thank okay. You. Thank you very much. Daniel wow. Verd. We've got a lot going on. Let's have a look. Thank Basically, you very much. Thank you so much. Daniel Verd. Compare it to the other snacks that we've had. Okay, so yeah, we have this one. Nuts snacks, chocolate. We have Himalayan salt with caramel popcorn, which looks great. Chocky croissant. It's Kachori slash samosa. Wow. Yeah. Alright, here. Okay. It's sort of like a And it's on the floor. <laughs> no kachori. Yeah, can I have a bite of yours? Yeah, okay. Be careful with it. Okay, so what essentially it is is like a little circle. Mmm. Half pastry ball. Yeah, 
Yeah, we're over halfway. So this train, like I said, Modi's involved. It's a big thing. Four minutes early, we have made it to Jodhpur. Are we going? Are you going? We yeah, are, yes. Just waiting. A little bit tired, but as you can see, what a train. Look at it. Immaculate. Still absolutely immaculate. And before we get off, let me just check. I haven't actually been. I don't know how. I have not been. But there is a toilet. Again. Pretty tidy. How have I not been to the toilet in six blooming hours? Hold on. You ready? You good? Three. Oh my god, imagine I'd fall down this side. <laughs> I nearly went. But welcome to the blue city here in Rajasthan. I feel like the t-shirt is pretty fitting. We now just need to figure out, well we don't need to figure anything out, we're going to order an Uber and go to our hotel. It's nearly midnight, well, 11 o'clock. The old you get. Yeah. Actually, I'm starting to feel these travel days. My legs ache, my knees hurt, I've got a headache. But it was good fun. It was good fun, it was worth it. The Vanda Bharat is always a high level experience in India. But yeah, please get me. Oh, hold on. I was about to say get me to bed, but this has got to be one of the best. Look at this. Look at the decoration, look at the walls here. At the airport. At the airport? At the train station, I'm telling you. I'm knackered. Get me to bed. <laughs> 